hello scientific brilliant people how are you today so today i'm going to perform the second part of the experiment of mapping up of magnetic field lines and finding the neutral points so in this part we are going to find the neutral points on the equatorial line in the last part we had found the um, neutral points on the axial line right so there is a slight change in the orientation of the bar magnet which i'm going to show you over here so in order to start the experiment what i have done is i have kept a compass like this and the compass needle itself is a magnet whose north is showing in this direction that means if we consider the earth as a huge magnet then the north of this magnet would be pointing towards the south of the other magnet so assuming the earth's magnet to be like this and its south pole would be over here right so you can call this direction as magnetic south or geographic north so i have already shown this is geographic north or magnetic south whereas this direction is magnetic north or geographic south correct okay so the if you consider a huge bar magnet under the earth right now then its south pole is over here north pole is on this side so to begin the experiment you need to put two dots along north and south of this needle and then make a straight line like this now what am i going to do is people i'm going to remove this compass and i'm going to put the north of my bar magnet in this direction like this now i'm going to make an outline so that during the experiment if the bar magnet moves we can again place the bar magnet at its own place correct now let's start by bringing this compass over here now we know how to point the magnetic field lines so let's start doing it people hold it very steady start with two points like this you are supposed to mark two points on either side of the compass needle and keep on doing this like this one now going for the second line you just have to go along with the flow of the magnetic needle people now somewhere over here my paper is actually ending right so i have drawn two magnetic field lines like this so third over here like this okay in this way like this
okay so i have already plotted half of the uh, for the half of the um, bar magnet on this side now let me actually mark it So people we know that the magnetic field lines they actually originate from north pole so this is north pole and they go towards like this and they go from north they end into south and from south pole the magnetic field lines they enter like this in this way correct now i'm going to draw the similar section for the upper half as well okay people so now we have drawn enough of the magnetic field lines and uh, now let's go for the neutral points so first of all let me remove this bar magnet and take a scale and the midpoint of the i'm going to just make a perpendicular line passing from the midpoint of my bar magnet now people this line is called the equatorial line now how do i know that the magnetic field is zero on the equatorial line it is because see from north pole the magnetic field lines will be going like this so that means the magnetic field line of this bar magnet will go like this and since the earth's magnetic north is on this side right and the earth's magnetic south is on this side so the earth magnetic field lines will come like this so somewhere there is chances of cancelling out on this part and on this part so that's why the magnetic field lines will cancel each other off and the net magnetic field will be zero and we will find that point just by the same method old method now let's gently move this okay so as you can see that this magnetic needle shows deflection means it can be resting in any position because here the net field is zero so i'm going to quickly mark this point this is our neutral point n1 now the same thing goes over here also you have to gently move this let me show you this very carefully okay so here we have obtained our second neutral point as well So two points, two neutral points on the equatorial line and this is how we do the experiment. So hopefully guys you have enjoyed the experiment. If you have any doubts please do comment in the comment section and thank you for watching the video.